I like to incorporate music in my Spanish classes, and I write a lot of music. So I, I thought uh, this year, one of my goals was to bring more, even more music into the classroom. We've been watching music videos, we do activities with songs. I thought, you know what, I'm going to write songs that go along with the different chapters in the book. Mucho gusto. The lyrics go up and are projected up on the board and their certain lyrics are covered up usually it's keywords vocab words or grammar that we're using and students try to pick them out while I'm singing the song we'll try to pick out and write down those words <laughs> So first students try to figure out what's going on in the song and listen and, and try to break it down and then uh, the students enjoy singing along as well. Most students would prefer to sing their vocabulary and their grammar in a song as opposed to working uh, in a, in a, on an activity in a book. What do we have down here? What are they called? As far as the teacher's concerned, they're getting just as much out of it um, without even really realizing that they're working on vocabulary and grammar. Here we go. En el verano hace calor, en el otoño hace fresco, en el invierno hace frío, en la primavera hueve mucho cuidado. Cuidado, el piso está mojado. Cuidado, cuidado, el piso está mojado. Y no hay sol, y no hay sol. Está nublado, está nublado. En el desierto bronceador, en las montañas hay un río. En el lago está cerro grados, no tengo miedo, no tengo miedo, cuidado, cuidado, el piso está mojado, cuidado, cuidado, el piso está mojado, y no hay sol, y no hay sol, está nublado, está nublado. La bufanda, la bufanda. El gorro, lo tengo. Las camperas, las tengo. Los abrigos, los tengo. ¿Por qué hace más? 